Well lads, home, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be letting my hens out. So, uh, it's a cold one this morning, the the jumpers that we were doing yesterday. Today's the, the 7th, so it's a sad day for me because Christmas is over, but yeah, it's, uh, it's cold. Everywhere is frozen and snowy. A red sky over there on the horizon. Red sky in the morning, shepherd's warning as they say. So this is the hen house here. We, um, My dad built it and I gave him a hand. So we built this in August when we got them. I saw some and then we just got a gate out of pallets. And then we have a second, I'll just, I don't know where I'll put you down. So, um, we have an electric fence here just to, to stop Mr. Fox from getting in. Um, and then we have... Now, the hens want to get out now, so... Come on, hens. So, we have six road what's it Rhode Island Reds and uh, so we got them in August it's January now so what uh, have them five months well this is the fifth month so they're probably about six months old um, so I just checked the water it's not frozen there's plenty in it and then I check for eggs and now it's a bit dirty in here I have to clean it out tomorrow just in there, and then we just go around to the the laying box. It's probably going to be hard for the hens to graze today because it's. Uh, I'll just say it's up on the tripod. It's just because it's. Um, it will be fairly frozen. Everything will be. Everything will be frozen, but. So it'll probably thaw out later, but it is very cold right now. That's not supposed to happen. Just push that down. And then we just put a little carabiner on it just to stop. Now he probably wouldn't, but the fox could get up at that, so. Yeah. Um, as you may have seen, it didn't go too well holding the camera or and uh, taking eggs out because it might have uh, dropped one. <laughs> Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, just leave that there. So they've got loads of meat. Oh, shake it down. I've actually got loads there this morning. I fed them yesterday. So this is just a little cover that goes on it to stop rain and snow and ice and whatever getting into it. So that's fairly weatherproof and then we have this big um drinker here and there's i don't know if you can see it but um so there's a little blue there's just in there there's a little blue um this little bl rubber toggle thing that you just pull up and it lets out and then just push it back down to close it so uh these are the hens this is my personal favorite don't tell the others so this is heather the white one and then the other ones i just kind of i can't tell them apart but they're very inquisitive so he's pecking the camera but so yeah that's the hens the really cool sky out here um it's, it's it says uh, as i said um red sky in the morning shepherd's warning so it's red sky at night shepherd's delight so i think it it just means that there's going to be bad weather i think but I don't know, usually when there's a frosty day like this, it, it generally turns out to be, or a frosty morning, it generally turns out to be a good day. So, the chickens are happy out there. They are, they all look content. So, I will just close up the, I'll just close up the, I'll just put the, we have a little fence. It's an electric fence here. 
It's just one of those the standard chicken fencing uh, electric netting, and um, that just lets them them graze without going on and uh, dumping on the patio because Dad got a new patio during the summer, and um, of all the places that they could poo in the garden, they had to do it on the patio. So uh, we put them in here, but we move it every so often. Just it's like strip it for raising cattle, look how it would hens. So that's it for me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and if you ha and don't forget to comment down below if you have any questions.